USC hosting San Jose State. Happy college football. I know we've all been waiting for it to be back. These are the Lions pre-kickoff, which happened on Saturday. Now, USC are 30.5 point favorites. The over-under is at 66.5. San Jose State is plus 2,400 on the money line, and USC is minus 10,000. Now, when I'm going to make these picks, it's going to be based off of the odds that we see here. If the odds shift dramatically, you may want to consider taking a different team or taking a different game. And I'll try to touch base back on these games on uh, kickoff day, like on Saturday. But I'm just trying to find a place to squeeze all of these games in. Now, they've played twice. USC is 2-0. The home team is 2-0. The favorite is 2-0 on the money line. And the favorite is 2-0 against the spread. The under has hit in there two games. The under is 2-0, and the under 66.5 is also 2-0 because you can see the two scores of the games that they've played right there. Those are the only two times that these teams have played each other. The spread is right there. USC 33.5, winning 56-3. USC 13.5 point favorites, winning 30-7, and the dates are listed right there beside me. Now we'll get to see if Caleb Williams is everything that everyone hoped for and dreamed of and that the fact that he's going to lock himself in at the number one pick although he always is but you know sometimes things like this happen where one guy is supposed to be the dude and then throughout the season someone else you know takes the league by storm so to speak now i do think that this should and i'm not trying to be too too sarcastic but this should be a cakewalk for usc especially with all of the offensive weapons that they've gotten that have transferred to that school because Caleb Williams went there from from everyone from Oklahoma and that transfer portal. This team should run San, Di San Jose State off of the field. I'm going to take USC with the money line. I'm going to take USC laying the points and I'm going to go over in this game. And I understand that there's no value on the money line. When I say that, that I'm going to take a team on the money line when they're minus 10,000 or 15,000. It just means I think they're going to win the game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.